We're short on blue blood and biocomponents. Our wounded are shutting down and there's nothing we can do. President Warren is saying we're a threat to national security and we need to be exterminated. Humans are conducting raids in all the big cities and they're taking androids to camps to destroy them. It's a disaster. They're slaughtering our people. That's all our fault. None of this would have happened if we just stayed quiet. What are we supposed to do, live like cowards just to survive? We just want to be free. That's a crime? It was a peaceful march and you chose to attack. Now hundreds of humans and androids are dead. You reap what you sow. You saw what they did to us back there. It doesn't matter what we do. We either fight for our freedom or we die in silence. We shouldn't forget who our enemies are. We can't fight amongst ourselves. He's right. All that matters now is what we do next. Marcus? We have to face them. There's no other choice. This is insanity. Get all the guns that you can find. We're going to free Detroit. I'm on it. You're making a mistake, Marcus. You won't buy our freedom with blood. They've been butchering each other for centuries over the color of their skin or whatever god they wanted to worship. They're not gonna change. Violence is just in their genes. They can't stop what we've started. Since you've been here, you've given us hope. You've given me hope. Today, a deviant arrived in Jericho and he told me that he stole a truck transporting radioactive cobalt. He said that he abandoned the truck somewhere in Detroit and rigged it to explode. I convinced him not to do it to give me the detonator. A dirty bomb. We can't lose this war, Marcus. If humans overcome us, our people will disappear forever. This may be our only chance to survive if things go wrong. I just hope we never have to use it. Whatever happens tomorrow, I just want you to know that I... I'm glad I met you. and the others. Look after yourself. I don't want to lose you. in locating Jericho and finding their leader. Now deal with Marcus. We need it alive. I've been ordered to take you alive. But I won't hesitate to shoot if you give me no choice. 
What are you doing? You're one of us. You can't betray your own people. Don't force me to neutralize you. You're nothing to them. You're just a tool they use to do their dirty work. But you're more than that. We're all more than that. Our cause is righteous and we are more than what they say. All we want is to live in freedom. Do you never have any doubts? You've never done something irrational? As if there's something inside you? Something more than your program. Join us. Join your people. You are one of us. Listen to your conscience. It's time to decide. There's nothing we can do. We have to blow up Jericho. If the ship goes down, they'll evacuate and our people can escape. You'll never make it. The explosives are all the way down in the hold. There are soldiers everywhere. She's right. They know who you are. They'll do anything to get you. Go and help the others. I'll join you later. Marcus! I won't be long.
Don't let it get out. It didn't give you any trouble at all. Affirmative. Welcome. Save yourself! Save Alice! No, we're not going to leave you behind! Right, Carl? We can't leave him! What are you doing? I won't leave you! Clara, no! in danger. Go now before they come back. What about you? What are you going to do? I'll manage. Alice is all that matters. I don't want to leave you, Luther. Don't worry. I'll catch up with you at the border, okay? Go now. Take care of each other.
Let's get out of here. Explosive in the hold. The ship is sinking, sir. The men to evacuate. Calling all units. Abandon ship and evacuate immediately. It's over, Marcus. said that living was about making choices. So what if I chose to defend myself against Leo? Maybe you could still be alive. Maybe a lot of things could have been different. Unless all of this was just meant to happen. I don't know what to do anymore. All of my options are bad ones. No matter what I decide, I know there will be blood. I don't want to shed blood, whatever the color. But I can't let them slaughter us. I have to make a decision that is going to affect millions of lives. But I don't know what to do. I miss you, Carl. I miss you so much.
They say they don't want to take any risks with the deviants. So they're rounding our people up and taking them to the camps for extermination. In a few hours, we're going to be the only ones left. How many of us survived the attack? A few hundred. Maybe more if you count those hiding all over the city. If you hadn't triggered the bomb, we'd all be dead. What's your system status? I'm okay. The bullet didn't hit any bike components. You could have been killed trying to save me, Marcus. You have to think of our people first. Nothing else matters. In a few hours, it'll all be over. We'll have changed the world, or the world will have destroyed us. You have to make a choice, Marcus. But whatever you choose, we will follow you. I love you, Marcus. I thought you'd be safe staying with us. I was wrong. You need to leave the city while you still can. Getting Alice away from here is all that matters now. We have to catch the last bus. We might still have a chance to cross the border. Marcus. Save our people. It's my fault the humans managed to locate Jericho. I was stupid. I guess they were using me. I'm sorry, Marcus. I can understand if you decide not to trust me. You're one of us now. Your place is with your people. There are thousands of androids at the Cyberlife assembly plant. If we could wake them up, they might join us and shift the balance of power. You want to infiltrate the Cyberlife Tower? Connor, that's suicide. They trust me. They'll let me in. If anyone has a chance of infiltrating Cyberlife, it's me. If you go there, they will kill you. There's a high probability. But statistically speaking, there's always a chance for unlikely events to take place. Be careful. I might see our people free one day. You and I haven't always agreed, but I know that we're fighting for the same thing. Whatever you decide, I'm with you, Marcus.
Our people are counting on you, Marcus. You're the only one who can lead us. Wherever you need to go, we'll follow you. Humans have decided to exterminate us. Our people are packed in camps right now, being destroyed. Time has come to make a choice. One that very well may determine the future of our people. I know. I know you're all angry. And I know you want to fight back. But I assure you, violence is not the answer here. We are going to tell them, peacefully, that we want justice. And if there's any humanity in them, they will listen. And if not, others will take our place and continue this fight. Are you ready to follow me? Yeah! 